I should be checking the map. I'm a little lost, TBH. So it looks like if I keep going down and as far right as I can go, there's a place I haven't been to yet. Actually, it also looks like I missed some other spots, so... I'm just kind of going back and forth, I suppose. See, this is why it's important to use maps, kids. So I've never been this way, is what it's telling me, I think. Yeah, this doesn't look familiar. Or it does look familiar and I'm just kind of sleeping. One of the two. Yeah, never mind, this does look familiar actually, so... Oh, I need to go down. I understand. I think a lot of this is- ooh. That frog was a little bit jumpy, I wasn't prepared for that. Um, I think a lot of this is gonna be me checking the map, trying to figure out where the hell I'm going. Oh, let's land right on that frog, shall we? Oh, here we go. There we go. I hope we see some more different enemies, because I feel... We've only seen like four different enemies at this point, and granted, we've only been playing for, what, 20 minutes? But I'm excited to see some more enemies. Some more different enemies. I'm just gonna let these guys go. They're not hurting anything. They're not hurting me anyway. Oh, I did not see that frog there. Maybe I should be wearing my glasses. That that would probably help. So it looks like I might need to be a cat. Oh no, wait, I can't be a cat. I need to do platforming. What is this? Me platforming? Never. Can I get up there? Probably from this platform. Ugh. I'm not good at platforming, guys. This is this is gonna be a struggle. Wait, can I Oh. It didn't work. It doesn't work at all. Okay. That just doesn't work. Okay. That almost worked. There we go. I don't- okay. For a second I was like, do I have to do that for every jump? That's gonna suck. No, you don't. I might have to do it for this jump. Yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna make this jump. I don't- I actually don't think I can make this jump. I think. Yeah. Yep. Okay. I see what's going on here, I think. Yeah, I can't make any of these jumps. Okay, I'm I'm coming to the conclusion that I'm missing a power-up, so. Um, if I go back and I go down, it looks like there's another room I can go to. I will meet you guys there. Just kidding, there is no way for me to go this way either, so. Oops. So I think I'm gonna go back to the beginning, where I was before I, I was checking the map. Okay, sounds good. I just never went to the right here, I guess? Okay, oh this is quaint, I like this. Always press buttons before knowing what they're going to do. What's this? Have I killed this man? Security facility log number 2312. It's like the- I, This is probably not a reference, but I'm probably going to draw some, some conclusions that are not true. It's like the, the Ocarina of Time puzzle in the Deku tree. 23 is number one. I don't know why it, it doesn't even make any sense. Okay, anyway. This is Jimbo reporting. The doctor has gone mad. The security systems have been modified to target all personnel in the compound. Most of my colleagues have either been killed or turned into one of those things. 
I'm fleeing via one of the surface level escape pods. And though I am unsure I'll survive, the trip back, my heart will always belong to the shores of Earth 2. Over and out. That's, that's kind of sad sounding. Way to be a downer, dude. So, turned into one of those things. That makes... Are there zombies? Are we gonna have some zombies here? Are those just lights? Those almost look like buttons up there. Can I drink the tea? Aw, oh, man. Okay. Well, we learned something, anyway. So, next up, we want to head to that left room, I think. So here- Allow me to- Again, I just failed to go to the left here? I guess? Not really sure how I made- Oh, I understand. That makes more sense. Aw, oh, I was hoping I could kinda get it- Get it in there more, do more destruction. There we go. Perfect. This looks a little ominous. A bit like a boss room. Press the buttons. Always press buttons without knowing what they're going to do, right guys? What the heck's... Something happening? Like, oh, it's an elevator! Nice, Kiki. You've reached... The Nexus. What's the Nexus? It's kind of scary sounding. All roads lead here. Think of it as a hub of sorts. A little on the nose, okay. Anyway, we need to find the laboratory entrance. Let's see what you got. He's still talking to a cat, I'd just like to point out. Neat. Over and out. That was a little aggressive. You've scared me, sir. I, I'm going to assume that button there is going to, um... Is going to make the elevator go again, so I probably don't want to press that. This button, however... Hmm, this is the main PC. Hello, PC. Seriously? Okay, this is another dumb comparison I'm gonna make, but that- The way the computer sounds sounds a lot like the voices in, uh, Mortis. <laughs> and now I'm scared. Uh, no need- No need to greet me as if I am one of your own, human. Um... Let's cut to the chase. See these signs? No. <laughs> no need to con condense. Con no need to condescend. Wow, I can read. PC? Yes, I see them. Very good, human. Well, this sign means broken. Oh, I, I see the signs now. Allow me to use my eyeballs. You want to turn them all into check marks. Like this. This is a check mark, human. Sassy computer. Here is your progress so far. <clears throat> Excessive flooding in the aqueduct. Not good. Heater core is still affected by severe overheating. Ventilation system is all clogged up. Nasty stuff. I can only grant lab access if all malfunctions are repaired. What a contemptible machine. Let's go, kitty. Okay. I'm gonna continue this direction, I think. There's more frogs. What's up? Ooh, I wanna go up. What? That was dumb. I shouldn't have done that. Ooh, I can break these! Finally, what I wanted. To be able to break blocks. And, and kill frogs. I didn't need to kill that frog. I did it because I wanted to. 
Ooh, that is some ASMR sounds right there. That is satisfying. Oh, an armadillo! Go away, bees. The, the flying things are always the most annoying enemies, whether you're playing Metroid or uh, Mega Man. It doesn't matter, they're all bad. The flying enemies are all bad. So it kind of looks like as a cat, I might be able... My mech fell. Well, I was hoping the mech wouldn't fall, but I might be able to climb up some of this? No. Nope. Just kidding. Okay. Well, let's go the other direction then. I can actually... I can go down up here. Down up here. Down over here. Um, what is this way? What is going on? What is this jet set radio beat? Oh. Am I going to enjoy this or is this a boss fight? Yikes! Don't shoot! Is that a cat in a robot suit? That's what I said when I first saw this game too, dude. I guess I'm one to talk. Yeah, you look like a frog. Achoo! Oh, he's allergic to cats, I get it. Listen, maybe we can help each other. I can modify your gun, but uh, I'm short on fuses. Bring me seven cartridges and we can talk upgrades. Achoo! Kiki, I'm afraid that I'm losing my grip. Yeah, I'm afraid of that too. Maybe maybe this is all just a hallucinations of a man who's lost a lot of blood and is going to die. <laughs> we better finish this mission before I croak. Wow. I agree. Okay, well that's cool. I don't I don't think this road's going to lead us any further, so. I like being able to see both ends of the tube, that's pretty cool actually. Um, allow me to cut- kill your cousin. And your cousin's friend. Oh, I missed. There we go. <sighs> what a satisfying noise. I have some, uh, wooden wind chimes that make a very similar noise. Maybe that's why I like it so much, but, uh, it's good stuff. Let us continue this way. Oh, a save point. I totally skipped this. And there we go. Health is restored, all the good stuff. I would just shoot boxes just to hear that noise, to be honest. Ooh, that armadillo was after me. Do you see that? Okay, now up here, I can definitely climb. Allow me to cat. Whoa, wrong way. Oh, I can't. Okay. Well, down here, I wouldn't be able to make it unless I was a cat. And there's nothing I can do here! Okay. Sad day. I can't, like, break those. No. Now, being not in the mech, probably things are gonna hurt more, right? Wow, I was not expecting that. Okay, um... Well, here I am, back in the mech, I guess, with more knowledge than I had before, at least. Um... Yeah! Unexpected, that was. Okay. okay. We'll just head up... I said, we'll just head up this way. Shoot everything in our path as one does. Now I don't- I definitely could not make that jump, so I think we'll go this way. And this looks terrifying. I'm kind of a little excited with all of these big jumps, I'm kind of thinking we're getting like a hover pack or something of that nature. Ooh, a button! Oh, it's an elevator. Neat. This must be going towards the aqueduct, because there's suddenly a lot of water and things dripping. It Correct me if I'm wrong, but aren't aqueducts supposed to be, like, not flooded, but lots of water? Isn't that the point? 
Okay, you've made it to the aqueducts, Kiki. Well done so far. Now to drain this water. Well, drain the water and you can finally stay dry. There you go. Reverse psychology or something. There's, there are three drains that you need to find. Uh, they should be connected to the corridor below. Easy. Yeah, you say that. <sighs> I can never tell if you're listening. As, as you do with cats. Over and out. So that button's probably for the elevator, and I'll need that. Is that a water mech? Do I get a different mech? Also, that octopus is adorable. And this- that was dumb. I can't shoot up, it turns out. I can- so... To describe to you what these- the underwater physics are like... What is the comparison I'm trying to make here? It's like... It's like water. Yeah, it's like water physics. It's a little bit like ice physics, actually. Very floaty. I guess it should be moving underwater. Oh, I like the water movies. Very nice. I'm quite impressed with the sound design in this game so far, as I've mentioned earlier. It, it doesn't look like I have missiles underwater. Like, I've got my gun. I need this octopus to move. Ah! Yep, I'm going to die. Here I go. I'm just sliding into everything. Okay, here we go. There we go. Now, I can't get up because, as mentioned before, I don't have any kind of missile, nor can I shoot in the up direction. I can only shoot side to side. So... Ooh, what is... This... What's interesting? What is that? Nothing. It is nothing. Exciting. Alright, here we go. Let me in! Oh, is this a boss? Take it back, I don't like it. They're like torpedo fish. Look at these Pokemon assholes. I feel like I'm gonna die here. Actually, this isn't- Once you get it, the hang of it, this is not that hard, I guess, but... As we all know, I'm not good at games. Cool. Actually, that was pretty easy, although I'm legit going to die. Ooh! <laughs> okay, that's satisfying. I need to- I need to have less sauce coming up, though. Okay, come on, Kiki. Yep, it's a daisy. Oh, my mech is gone. Or it sunk. One of the two. I guess it's not really a mech, it's a, like a sub. Speaking of mechs, I get mine back. Nice. Okay, here we go. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Please let me know if you're enjoying this project so far. And stay tuned for another episode of Gato Roboto.